407 years ago today, a group of men in the pay of the Roman Catholic Church decided to blow up the British Houses of Parliament. They were protesting at what they saw as the new liberation of the British public by the formation of the Protestant Church. They were protesting against the emerging emancipation of women, the first signs of free speech and the first signs of true democracy coming. Obviously it got stopped, hence the legend of Guy Fawkes. In today's age, and especially in 2012, with the Uranus-Pluto square going on in the heavens, the concept of not so much revolution, but perhaps re-evolution, involving a greater recognition of the need for a healthy environment, a clear demonstration of the equality of feminism and women's rights, a greater commitment to free speech all around the world, and a cessation of big government. All of these things are in the air, as is the downfall of the mega profit corporate capitalist society. This is all coming in the next couple of years. And perhaps today is a day where, with all the bonfires happening, at least in the English speaking world, in celebration of the failure of the attempt to reincorporate the Church of England into the Roman Catholic Church. There's a case for saying, don't we all have a right for our individual freedom of speech? I note that in the last 24 hours, a group whom I know of, but I have absolutely no contact with, a group called Anonymous, have taken down NBC, Jay Leno Show, Saturday Night Live, and I believe, according to what I see on the internet in the last hour or so, that Facebook is currently experiencing difficulties. Anonymous is a bunch of hackers. I don't commend them. I don't support them. I sympathise with some of their motives. And today, on November the 5th, it's a day where we should all start thinking about our own willingness to commit ourselves to the future, to stand up for what we truly believe to be right, our own personal freedom. So, in commemoration of this time, 407 years ago, perhaps. Remember, remember the 5th of November, gunpowder, treason and plot. In this day and age, I see no reason why the 5th of November should ever be forgot. Have a great time.